The attenuation process is a way in which prokaryotes stop transcription of the structural genes after transcription has already occurred, accidentally. In this animation, I'm going to use the trip operon as an example of the attenuation process in prokaryotic gene regulation. The trip operon is composed of tryptophan structural genes that code for proteins that make tryptophan. Trip L is the leader region. Inside the leader region is an attenuator. The attenuator includes a transcript with four regions. The transcript has been made by RNA polymerase. Region 1 is particularly important. It contains two trip codons that determine the rate in which the ribosome translates. Each region can complementary base pair with each other because they are palindromic. If tryptophan levels are low, the ribosome pauses because there are only a few trip tRNAs available, so it waits for one to arrive. Meanwhile, RNA polymerase is synthesizing region 4. Due to the fact that region 4 is not completed, region 3 base pairs with region 2. This does not stop transcription and the ribosome eventually continues to translate once trip tRNAs become available. When tryptophan levels are high, the ribosome does not pause and zips along the transcript from region 1 to region 2. Region 3, therefore, cannot base pair with region 2 because it is being occupied by the ribosome, so instead it base pairs with region 4. Region 4 contains a termination sequence and this gives the signal to stop transcription before it even gets to the first trip structural gene which is trip E.